Alright guys, so welcome to this tutorial and I'm gonna teach you how to make a really nice epic film title. Alright, so let's just start immediately. So the first thing that you're gonna do if you are in DaVinci Resolve, you're gonna go to your media pool right up in the edit page. You're gonna click on your right and you want to create a new fusion composition. Yeah, so let's do that. Let's name it film title bomb. All right, so the second thing that we're gonna do, we're gonna open this one in the Fusion page. All right, so we are now in the Fusion tab and in this tab, we're gonna create the film title. Here you see text and you click on this icon and you just import it into your um, yeah thingy where you're gonna work. So before you're gonna create a title, you want to think about how many titles you're gonna create uh, let's say we want to create one main title and we want to name it, uh, click on your right and we want to rename it, let's say Lonely, Lonely Nights, that's the first title or main title. Then we want to create a second title and that second title we're going to rename and let's say uh, Film by all right all right okay then we want to make a third title and let's rename that as well and we're gonna name it a film by John Wick <laughs> oh yes all right so now we created three text titles and now we want uh, to have something on the screen where we can start working in. So to connect everything with each other we need to import a merge between these uh, titles. So let's do that. So let's connect the first title to the merge and then we want to have our second merge where we're going to connect our second title with so this is how I do it. Maybe there's a quicker way, faster way, but this is how I do it and I like it. So if you connect the merge to each other and you connect it to the media output, you will see uh, eventually uh, on the screen uh, your titles and you can start to work. So let's do that. Connect the merge with each other. And outputs and right up here you see where we're gonna start working in. To have a better overview about where your titles are gonna stay and how high and low your titles are gonna be, you want to click on your right up here, you want to go to guides and you want to sh show your guides, all right? That's very important, I really love to work like this. So let's create the first title, all right? So I click on the first title and I'm gonna type in Lonely Nights, all right? So I really love this, um, but I don't like the font of it. So let's grab a font, let's grab this one, and then we can uh, start to change uh, everything on our Lonely Nights title. So where do we want to have the title? Um, and how big needs the title to be. So let's first just decide the color. I just really love this orange yellow uh, kind of color. And now I want to put it and definitely a little bit bigger, right the size. Then I want to have that tracking a little bit, give that cinematic look. All right. And then I want you can do like many cool things up here. Just uh, dive deep into this and figure out everything on yourself. But for me, and to keep this uh, tutorial short but quick, uh, we're just gonna keep it simple. Uh, and we're gonna change the layout, right? So uh, we're gonna put up the Y. So you can put it up and down. Let's put it up like this. All right, and it's already in the center, but the X is going to the left and to the right. And double click, it's back to where it is. So let's put it back up. Okay, that's, that's cool. So basically, I like this. Let's go to the other title, a film by. So type in a film, 
film by let's grab um, all right so let's grab this one and change the color and now we can decide uh, I'm gonna definitely gonna make it a bit smaller all right we gonna put it a little bit more down oh where are you like here and that's okay for me just the tracking a little bit more all right so then we have our third title and we're gonna name it john wick john wick all right give it exactly the same color and the same font i really love this font where are you oswald and now we can decide oh gee John Wick, I love everything with the caps lock on. And so now we're gonna change the layout. And ooh, this looks already so good. So very precise. Then we're gonna do the tracking. So um, when I create this, I'm always aware of that some letters match with each other, all right? For example, the Y and the E. So let's, let's, let's match it up, all right? So make it a bit, I'm gonna put this a little bit up. <laughs> Don't like it, like this, a little bit more air, a little bit more breathing air. All right, and this one, maybe the tracking. So now I match the N with the F. That's better, something like this. Yeah, like it. All right, so let's say that you want to save this uh, film title and you want to use it in your other pro project, but you want to be able to change the name, for example, John Wick, a film by, or Lonely Nights. You can simply do this by selecting all of these titles and merges, click on your right, and then you go to uh, macro, because you want to create a macro. You will name it uh, film. And in here, I'm gonna show you what you need to do because this is a lot of work. And um, right up here, you see uh, we created Lonely Nights, a film by John Wick, Merge, one, two, three. And right up here, you see exactly the same. So now you're gonna um, choose what you want to save. And this is very, very important that you do this the right way. So you want to save the text, right? So let's say, I want to save the style of the text. Uh, I want to change the font, style, color, green, blue, alpha, size. Tracking, and blue, blue, blue. Line spacing, I don't want. I think this is just enough. Then we're gonna go to our layout and right up here, I want to save everything. So this is what we're gonna do with, you can do that with your transform, shading, or your command, but this is okay. Then we're gonna go to a film by. Your merge is automatically uh, connected to your input, sorry, to your output, that's okay. All right, so that's it. So now you're gonna close it and then it's gonna ask you where you want to save it. And if you want to save it, yes, I want to save it. And where do you save this, guys? Very important, you go to your Fusion and you go to... Uh, mm, 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 mm. Templates, you go to Edit, 
you go to titles and right up here you can save your film title so let's save it so now we're going to close DaVinci we're going to open up DaVinci again all right so now we are back in DaVinci again and um, let's say that we have this really cool clip right up here and we want to have our film title let's go to our fact and we're gonna type in YouTube film title for YouTube right up here BAM and you see you created your film title the cool thing about this is that you can change every single thing up here because we just saved it right so let's say a film by we want to have that a little bit higher so let's do that simply by changing our Y position um, let's say John Wick we want to have that also a little bit more higher like this or we want to change the spacing let's make it like this just whatever you like and you have a really cool great film title